We have an update now to a story that aired on CTN Journal a little over a year ago. It involves a local woman trying to get her first book published. His own eyes, blue, red-rimmed, haggard, stared back. His heart slammed against his rib cage, either from adrenaline or physical exertion. Maybe both. He glanced at his wristwatch and his heart lurched. 9.57. Anxiety gripped his chest. He didn't have much time. Jennifer describes Charlie's mirror as a bit like Back to the Future meets Animal House with a sprinkle of mean girls. Like her idol, Stephen King, yeah. Jennifer hopes to one day see yeah, her yeah, book yeah. on the shelf. Jennifer DeVries tried to get her novel Charlie's Mirror crowdfunded. When that didn't work out, she continued to pursue dozens of publishers until she struck gold with City Limits Publishing, a recent startup out of Nashville. I signed the contract in September. My book was published in December and it is available everywhere books are sold. You know, you can get it at Barnes and Noble, it's out on Amazon, it's on um, ebook, all the ebook reader platforms. Um, and that's just, it's just really cool. And they're very supportive, they love their authors, and it just ended up being a really, really good fit for me. In just a little over a month, around 600 copies of the book have been sold. Jennifer has already written a second book, A Ghost Story, which will be published in September. For more information on the author, log on to brendalynn.com.